Hello and welcome. This video is brought to you by the streamingadvisor.com. Tailor your entertainment with streaming. Today is a very exciting day because we're showing off a new service called Sling Television. What is Sling Television? It's a service that allows customers to watch cable channels through a new app without having to be signed up for any kind of a cable subscription. The service costs twenty dollars and you sign up for it via Sling's website. The website is linked to the description for this video. The service allows a lot of popular channels to be available for that twenty dollar fee. It includes ESPN, ESPN2, the Food Network, HGTV, and soon AMC, along with CNN and a number of others. Some of them aren't as well known as others. I've never heard of Maker, for instance, or L. Ray Network, which is sort of a movie action channel sort of marketed towards Hispanics. But in general, this is a kind of a compelling package. As of the filming of this video, the service is available on Roku. It's also available on PCs and Mac computers, along with other devices like Android devices and iOS devices through apps. The service will soon be available on Xbox One, the Fire TV, and the Google Nexus Player. For sports fans who can't get enough to watch on ESPN or the baseball on TBS and the NBA basketball on TNT, Dish offers a $5 sports upgrade package that includes the rest of the ESPN network package, as well as a couple of their sports stations. There are also $5 upgrade packages for news and even kids family packages that includes more Disney content. The thing is that Dish does not force you to pay for a bunch of channels that you don't want in order to get the ones that you do want. I think it was a great idea to package a lot of these channels together because it kind of takes care of the family discussions. Some people don't want to get rid of the Food Network. They love cooking shows. My family loves them. We, we planned whole meals around things like diners, drive-ins, and dives. Yeah, it's not healthy, but man. Something else that this thing does is it allows you to cycle through different shows. You can see what's coming on next, and in some cases you can see what's come on before. That service isn't available on every single channel. I believe HGTV is one that it is. Like you can actually back up. But from its main menu, you can take a look at a lot of things. You can also access movies from their blockbuster catalog. These are pay-per-view movies. Who doesn't need one more pay-per-view movie service, right? But I think that this is a really nice deal. There's a lot of people who have said, you know, I sure wish I could get ESPN without cable. If I could, I would drop it in a second. Well, cable companies have for a long time said that that wasn't possible or that it would be too expensive. Now you have a choice. You can decide whether you want to give it a shot or not. Now one thing this doesn't include is local channels. That's due to a complicated issue that we don't have time to discuss in this video. Luckily for those who live in places with decent antenna reception, the local channels are not an issue. But for those who live in valleys and heavily forested areas, I'm afraid you're still stuck without the live local TV. But in general, I think this is a great step forward for the kind of TV that people have been asking for for years and been denied.
I hope this video was helpful. If you thought so, please subscribe to this channel and share this video with your friends. For more information on Sling TV, check out thestreamingadvisor.com. And while you're there, sign up for our email updates. I'm Ryan Downey, the Streaming Advisor. Stream on, my friends.